What's up guys? It's your girl the Swaggy Bum, your style guide for doing a lot with a little. Today is Wednesday, so you already know we're only talking about fashion on the YouTube page today. I have a fun video for you guys. It's going to be an ASOS haul slash try on. I'll show you guys the big box. Oh, it's heavy. Well, it's not that heavy, but I'm dramatic. Okay. So, as you can see, big old box. <laughs> um, I actually didn't buy much. I don't know why it was bought in this big old box. Well, delivered in the big old box to me. I have a pair of shoes, a blazer, a dress, a coat. Um, and I think that's pretty much all I bought. So, I'll be showing you guys. And then, from there... I'll try on everything so that she can see how it fits. I can see how it fits. I haven't tried on anything yet. I did just open it to make sure that everything was there. Um, but I'll try on everything and then you guys can help me make decisions on if I should keep it or mix it. So first up, we'll start with these shoes that I got. And they are really cute. Look at that. I love how they have the square toe. Um, you know, that's really on trend right now. The heel is not too bad. It's not too high to me. I think the hardest part would be this because I don't have an arch in my foot, so I'm flat footed. So whenever I wear shoes like this, it just feels like pain on the bottom of your foot. So I might just have to put like a little insole here. It is a little cushy though, so maybe I won't need it. I don't know if you guys can see how I'm pushing in. It has the comfort right there, but I just might need a little insole just so that like the bottom of my feet don't get, um, like you know how it rubs and then it gets red. So we'll try those on and see how they're looking, feeling and fitting, but cute. And I also don't have like a simple black shoe like all of my black shoes either have like a pop of color or a detail or like multiple straps so i just wanted something simple something you could wear with jeans or you know a nice dress and they're really cute they're really cute oh you see that arch i ain't got that sis foot go like this <laughs> i'm a little scared of that but we'll see all right, what's next to come out the goodie bag? All right. This blazer I ordered. It was so cute on the model online. And it have like this little belt, detachable belt. So I was like, oh yes, I'm here for it. All right. Okay. That's cute. She cute. Um, I got a size six but she is looking a little big i don't know if you guys can see she's looking a little big she's looking um a little man sweaterish but we'll see and then this is the belt you just clip it over and i thought that was really cute also something that's very on trend right now so we'll see how that fits Put this to the side Next. Oh, this dress was so gorgeous online. It has like a kimono sleeve and you guys will see it when I try it on. Let's see. Oh, look at this beauty. It looks so vintage. Look at these details, the sparkle. I am obsessed. It has the back out, which I love. Oh, I can't wait to try this one on. She is cute. That's like perfect for a holiday party or something, or like a spring or summer wedding. That is just beautiful. Oh, I'm, I'm, I'm gagging over here. It looks like something you would find in like your thrift store back in the day. I haven't really been shopping thrift lately because I just feel like Everything I find in the thrift store is things I could find in your local store, like Zara and ASOS. So it's just like, what's the point 
when I shop thrift, I want to feel like I'm finding vintage clothes, one of a kind, like no one else is going to have it. Now you go to thrift stores and it's the same thing that's in regular fast fashion. I don't, I don't understand. I think the best practice for shopping in thrift stores now is like do it outside of your local country or state. Um, so like when I went to Seattle, I went to the thrift store out there and it was so good. It was like so much vintage pieces and a, a lot of designer pieces being there at thrift stores. I don't know what type of money they got out there to just be selling <laughs> designer to regular thrift stores, but I was pleasantly surprised. I think I bought like these Ted Baker loafers out there and I think I paid like 30 bucks. I ain't mad. I ain't mad at all. All right, next piece. I've really been wanting a teddy coat. Ooh, this is cute. And I love how this one has the detail here. You already know green is my favorite color. It has a really cute inside detail. Again, very vintage-y. Um, kind of looks like your grandmother, your grandmother's uh, sofa back in the 70s and 60s. But I'm here for it. And it's really soft. Mmm, feels nice, feels nice. All right, and the last thing I bought was a pair of leggings. I don't know why I've been so obsessed with leggings lately, but I've really been loving them. Like, <laughs> I've been wanting to wear leggings all the time and I realized that I don't have any more. I have zero leggings, so got a pair. And this one is in a neutral color because I think it's cute to wear like neutral palettes in the winter. It's like winter whites and stuff. That's cute. Hopefully it's not too long for me. Hopefully it doesn't show. It doesn't look see-through. Oh, a little bit. I guess you can see a little bit of my finger here. So I might have to just wear like neutral colored panties or black panties. Look at that. Oh yeah, you could see that. That's not cute. That's not cute. Ooh, we'll see what happens when I try these on. Uh, they might have to go back to ASOS <laughs> because that's one thing I cannot go for. All right, so I'm gonna go and try all these things on and then you guys can help me to decide if I should keep or if I should mix it. Be right back. This is what I'm wearing today. It's a complete Zara look. I purchased these pants from Zara last year during their um, holiday winter sale. And so I really love them. I love how high-waisted they are. And then a cute little sweater crop top. I feel like Christmas right now, like with the red and white. But yeah. All right, so this is my look. I'm going to go change and I think I'll try on the leggings first. Let's see. All right. So the pants, as you can see, they're high waisted. This is how they look in the back. Um, not sure if you can see lining, but this is like an example of how I would wear it. And I'll even show you guys like a full. So you can see they are just a smidge bit long for me. But long on me, I should say, but not bad. I think they're cute. So I'm not sure if I'll keep them yet, but I do like the idea of them. I really like the color on me. <laughs> so we'll see. All right. This is how I imagined wearing it. Like, my boyfriend is dying for me to go ice skating with him. So I figured maybe if I wore like a cute little outfit, it might encourage me to go. So like something like this with some boots and like a little fur 
headband or something can be really cute. It could be a look. Ooh, the jacket. You can try on the jacket with it. It's shutting just a little bit, but it's not real. So gotta expect that. Okay, this is cute. This is a look. Like, look at these details. Okay, look how chic this is. All right. The sleeve is a little long on me, but I like my things oversized, so I'm not too mad about that. Love the detail, gives it a pop of color. So I'm kind of feeling this. Really cute. Really cute. It's warm too. I feel like I'm getting hot in here. It has pockets because your girl always needs some. Put everything in there. This is cute. This is like a cute little look. Nothing crazy. I can definitely go ice skating in this, Aaron shopping in this. This is cute. All right, so now we'll just try on the jacket over. Or, okay. Yeah, oh my God, look how big this is on me. This is so big. It's like a dress. Almost. Let me see if I back up. Like, if I wore short dresses, I would wear this, you know, to the club. Like, ooh, 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 ooh. <laughs> what really made me want this was the color. So I don't have anything this color. And then I really loved how it came with this detachable belt bag. Like, I thought that was so cute but I just think it's too big. I don't want to always have to judge the sleeve. Look at that. I'll get up close for you guys. Look at this. Details. Love, I love this belt bag. If I can return it and keep the belt bag, that would just make my day. So I think this is really cute. Yeah, so that's the details. I don't know, at first glance, I think I already know that this one's going back because she's just too big. I like oversized, but it still has to be tailored to me. This just doesn't feel like it's doing it, so. All right. What's next? Let's try on the dress. My favorite dress. I feel like I'm going to end up keeping that dress, and that one was the most expensive piece. We're not going to talk about pricing right now. I'll, I'll let it shock you guys on your own. <laughs> no, I'll put the link to everything below in the description so that if there's anything that you see that you like, you can go ahead and get it as well. So, all right, I'll be back. I'm going to go try on the dress. Okay, look, just look at this gorgeous dress. Oh my God, the back. It's a little tight in my hips, but you know what, I wouldn't even exchange it or return it because it fits so perfect everywhere else i am trying to lose a little weight so maybe by the spring it'll be a little bit looser i'm just gonna pull down the oh, all right yes i love the little boobage here i love the bat sleeves like kimono style I'll just show you guys all the details because it is so beautiful. Look at this. I'm telling you, you're going to want to invite me to your wedding in the spring so I can wear it. Like, it's so gorgeous. 
I am absolutely in love with this dress and all of its details. It's so beautiful. Like, look how it just sparkles. It is just a beauty. It really is. It really is. I love it. I love the neckline. I love everything about it. Gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay. I think I'm sold. I don't even need you guys' opinion. I think I got this one. <laughs> put this back down and I'll try on the shoes because that's the last thing to try on now bear with me my feet are not done so don't go judging me okay <laughs> don't play with me just that first take they don't feel so bad All right, let me just get down here we have the shoe and I think it's really cute. And I'll show you guys what it looks like in the mirror. All right. Yeah. She is a keeper. The shoes don't even feel bad either. So far. Don't mind my dirty mirror. I don't know how honey got on it, but I can't get it off. But yeah, like she's just very elegant. She's like a a park wedding, you know, an outdoors wedding, um, early day wedding. Yeah, I am, oops, <laughs> I am completely sold on this. You can see the back, the opening, so beautiful, so beautiful. All right, guys, that is a wrap on my mini haul from ASOS. Um, I purchased everything during Black Friday, so it arrived pretty quickly. Um, so far, I feel like I know for a fact I'm keeping this dress. But please leave comments. Tell me what you think. Let me know what you think I should be keeping or nixing. I'd love to hear from you guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment on all of my videos. You can go back and watch any of my old hauls, any of my previous videos. I love and appreciate you for watching. Don't forget to hit that little bell in the corner for notifications so you know when I drop my videos. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm just so excited. I'm like loving this dress. I'm waiting. I'm like, who's getting married? Who's having a baby shower? Something, something I can go to in the spring. I'm excited. Anyways, guys, thank you again for watching. It's your girl, the Swaggy Bum, your style guide for doing a lot with a little. Bye.